What is up guys, welcome back to another trip to thrift. This is number 78. If you are enjoying these videos and you want to see more, please hit that like button, subscribe down below, go ahead and drop a comment and share the video. I'm actually on my way to the thrift store right now, so let's go see what we can find. I hate when people say My Hero Academia is the anime version of this movie. We got some games right here. I don't know if I'm gonna get these first two. Uh, Legends of WrestleMania, everybody knows I'm a big wrestling fan. Uh, then we got Fight Night Round 4. These games were always fun. I'm getting for sure Mario Kart Wii, which I find this game all the time. This one and uh, New Super Mario Bros. Wii, so for five bucks, it's worth it. This game's like a $20 game. Found these Prestos. They're from, they're from 2002, but it looks like somebody like ripped the cage off and everything. <laughs> they want $3.99 for these, but these things are pretty beat. Yo, the crappy remake of Bomberman. That ain't my Bomberman. Found the camo cowboys um, beanie. I don't know why it slipped my mind. For only $2.99, and uh, everybody knows that I'm a big cowboys fan. For $3.99, I found the champion Dallas Cowboys tee. Size XL, my size. And then size youth XL, but it's in the men's XL section. For $8.99, we got the T Mac jerseys. Uh, he was pretty good on the Rockets, but it was the Raptors when he was really good. Dollar forty-nine. <laughs> Why does this look like if uh, Donkey Kong and Mario had a baby? It's kind of disturbing. For four ninety-nine, we got the LeBron James Adidas Cavaliers jersey. It is a size large, but yeah, for five bucks, not too bad, I guess. We found the Dennis Rodman Dallas Mavericks Pro Player tee for $1.49, size medium. So for $1.99, I found this Industrial Light and Magic shirt, um, Lucas Arts for, like I said, $1.99. Uh, I'm not really familiar with it, but there's one on eBay kind of similar to it, but in maroon going for like, well, they're selling it for 50 bucks and it has like 11 watchers, so... I might just go ahead and take the gamble on this one for two bucks. The Motionless and White tee for 95 cents. I am a fan of Motionless and White. Finally, a shirt that understands my struggle. What are those? These are the newer ones, but somebody repainted them, if you can even hear me. Who watches John Charlie? We have the two wrestling tees. This is the Enzo and Cass. Uh, Enzo got fired. I uh, don't want to speak on why about that. <laughs> and then we got the Cesaro. Um, size medium though or else I would get this one. I remember wanting a pair of these back in the day. I think these are like the Reebok Blast or something like that. They want $17 for these. We're at Plato's. Let's go see what we can find this week. Some Los Angeles chucks. These are kind of crazy, these Barclays. It's like this lizard looking size 7 for $25. These are crazy looking. I think these are the Godzillas. I'm pretty sure that's what they are. They have like a crazy insole too. But like all the green is like 3M. These are pretty cool. Like if these were my size, I'd get them. Some like navy blue suede Air Forces, 35, size 10. Here's some like bread Air Max Ones for 30 bucks, size 12. Some all red Janowskis. These are pretty cool for only 18 bucks. Some shell toes for 20 bucks. I was gonna buy a pair of these one time, but I don't like that split tongue. Some more gelites. These have like a galaxy interior. Some gray Stan Smiths. These are really tiny. <laughs> They're size four, even though they say five and a half. I always get asked, how do you know that the shoes you're buying aren't fake? Well, 
you just gotta know what to look for. Like, look at this. These are fake. <laughs> you can tell by the air unit and just by the way they look. And then another example right here. Look how fake these look. You just gotta know what you're looking for. If you wanna score yourself a princess, guys, these are the three steps you gotta follow. Bling bling, cool ride, and power up. Who out there remembers Super Monkey Ball? One banana, two banana, three banana. You got the Sega on the sleeve, and then on the back. Unfortunately, it has some boogers or something on it. It's pretty disgusting. Everyone complaining about Snapchat right now. They got all these, but they're not worth really nothing. Um, they did have this one, but it looks like somebody stole it, of course. Here we have the reversible Nautica navigation. It is reversible, it's green on the other side. They want $16.81 for this one. But, I don't know. It's pretty dope. I might have to grab this one. And it has the hidden hoodie. And also, for $12.81, I found the Polo Sport, like, windbreaker jacket. You got Polo Sport right there on the chest. It's in, like, this uh, forest green color. This one is um, pretty clean, too. It does have, like, somebody spilt, like, glue on it or something, but I don't know. I might have to grab this one, too. And then check out what I found for $1.49. We got the Starter 1996 Champion Chicago Bulls tee. This one is for sure going in the personal collection because um, these starter shirts do fit a little big, so this one should fit me. This one says it's a medium, but this one looks like a large too, and this one's $2.99, and this is the back-to-back -back 1997 championship. So these two are definite cops. We got that Mario playing basketball, and on the back, you got Diddy and Donkey Kong. And then for two bucks, I found this um, Real Madrid Youth Small um, jersey. For only two bucks, maybe. They have these mid-top Roshis for $25. Um, I don't know, I was never a fan of the mids. They look weird to me. We got Wii Sports Resort for 95 cents. Um, I think it trades in the GameStop for like four bucks, so I'll probably just do that. And then the GOAT movie right here, Pokemon the first movie. If you didn't cry during this, then there's something wrong with you. They have these infrared threes and I used two and a half Y for $2.99, but these things are beat. And here's some like crazy looking Hirachis in like this pink, gray, and yellow colorway uh, for 25 bucks. They're still in good shape. They still got the Nike Air and everything on the inside. Some Full Metal Alchemist. And I don't care what nobody says. This is the GOAT Dragon Ball Z movie right here. That top notch GameCube title. Some more Full Metal Alchemist. And then this uh, Jeff Hardy collection, which I already have, so I don't need it. Some KD6 Christmases. These are really small, size 4Y. They want $3.99 for these. And on this side, there's some camo ones, size 7, missing the laces. And then a little bit farther down, we have some beat up LeBron. What are these, the 13 lows, I think? Uh, these are only $2.99, but they're pretty beat. For $1.99, I found Spyro Enter the Dragonfly, and then Mountain Bike Adrenaline, which I want to say I heard a review on this game, and this game's supposed to be kind of fun. Um, I don't know if it was this one. I'm going to have to look and see. For $2.99, I found this Huff shirt, this uh, like maroon tie-dye and white. Size medium, though, so it's too small for me. I found these Air Max 90s in this brown colorway for $8.99. They're size 12. And then for $4.99, I found this uh, Nautica Fleece pullover in this, like, dookie green plaid colorway. <laughs> I don't know. For 5 bucks, what do you guys think? They have these yellow camo um, curry ones. They're a size 8.5, though. They're only $12.81 because of this. If they were, like, uh, at least a 9.5, I'd probably get them to hoop in, but I'm probably going to leave them. They got the Cinco de Mayo Air Forces, which I think they are, size seven and a half. For 10 bucks, I found the um, Chicago Blackhawks. 
jersey by Reebok. It's a size large. The only issue with it really is it has this stain down here at the bottom. Uh, I don't know. I was thinking about getting it for personal wear. Also found the Justin Timberlake Justified Tour 2003 T. Uh, this one's a 2XL. This would be 250, so I don't know. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please hit that like button, subscribe, and leave a comment, share the video, and I will see you guys next week with another one, so later.